This procedure video will take you through the techniques of inserting a chest drain using a Seldinger technique. It is now becoming current practice that in most non-traumatic situations a Seldinger approach can be used for placing a chest drain. Again, as with all procedures, a formal introduction, a clear explanation and the obtaining of verbal consent is always essential. Take some time now to familiarise yourself with the equipment shown above and also to consider the indications for placing a chest drain. Take time to go back and look at the British Thoracic Society guidelines on chest drain placement for a pneumothorax. OK, so I'm going to find the anatomical marking for the um, insertion of the chest drain and what I want to find is the, uh, the triangle of safety, the, the base of which is at the level of the fifth rib. Uh, and I find the fifth rib by feeling for the angle, uh, the sternal angle, feeling across and finding the second rib, and then down, third, fourth, fifth. And if you follow it around, it's usually around about the level in a man of the, of the nipple. And insert, for the insertion site of the chest drain, I want to go just anterior to the mid axillary line. I'm going to clean the skin with some suitable antiseptic solution, chlorhexidine and alcohol mixture.